On June 27th, the Illinois NAACP State Conference and Illinois Association of Chiefs of Police joined to host a World Cafe Summit in downtown Peoria. The event followed a series of nine previous World Cafe discussions held around the state. Back in 2015, when uh, uh, we talked about starting this and doing the first outreach to uh, George Miss Mitchell with the NAACP in Evanston, uh, I was wondering where this is going to go. Is this something that's going to fall flat in the next year? Or? The World Cafe Summit was designed to bring community and law enforcement leaders back together again to discuss the next steps for the 10 shared principles. Here we are four or five years later and uh, I'm here at a conference with at least 150 people here from both sides of the fence. The affirmation of shared principles was established by the ILACP and NAACP to rebuild trust and relationships between the black community and law enforcement. We have this great partnership and that if you want to improve your, your agency, improve your relationship, or even survive as a police chief, these are the things you got to do. Facilitating the event alongside ILACP Executive Director Ed Wojcicki was Lieutenant Governor Juliana Stratton. In the beginning, the Lieutenant Governor facilitated the first four World Cafes when she worked with the UIC Center for Public Safety and Justice. Now that she's been elected, uh, she's been very excited about com coming back and working with us again. And so we, she has a history with us, so we're very pleased about that. Among the crowd of participants were not only community leaders in law enforcement, but student leaders as well. I'm sitting at a table with a lot of other police officers in law enforcement and um, another president of the NAACP. It's so cool to see like their perspective and then show my pr perspective so we can get an understanding of what's the problem and where we're trying to get to and our aspirations and goals. Many of the youth shared major gratitude for being a part of the event, but also expressed the desire to develop a future partnership with law enforcement to engage more of their peers. My aspirations is definitely bring the youth it's the office into law enforcement, and so that's why I want to like the people in Springfield. While each principal was broken down, individuals were invited to the microphone scattered throughout the room to share each table's discussion with the group at large. One of the things we talked about was making sure that uh, the escalation train didn't just become another buzzword that we used to uh, just check off a box and say that we're doing something. It is both organizations, the ILACP and NAACP's desire to have a mutual passion for defending and protecting the civil rights of all citizens and in keeping communities safe. You are representing something that is bigger than yourself. This is bigger than us here in this room. We are looking at a change that can go all throughout and have ripple effects throughout our country.